Hi, you all. Angela Gilbert Cameron here. I pray and hope you all are having a great and fascinating day. I had to look up and make sure that we are definitely filming in the name of Jesus. You all, we have made it almost to and through the end of October 2020. In the name of Jesus, to God be the glory. We're not... Uh, at all taking that for granted. We know that God has definitely been faithful. He's definitely been uh, a source of, um, of so many different things in the name of Jesus that I just can't even name one. I can't boil, I can't boil it down to just one in the name of Jesus. Personally, uh, some of the things that I have been believing God for, for a couple of months, he allowed to come to pass this month you all in the name of jesus so i truly truly am grateful and i just want to share that testimony with you all of the goodness and faithfulness of god i won't go into detail more than one thing but when i tell you god is faithful god is definitely faithful you just have to keep your eyes on him you have to keep your mind on him and you have to be persistent in your faith you all to know that what he has spoken in his word cannot go void in the name of Jesus. When God has spoken to us in and through his holy Bible, you all, stand firm on it because his word can never, can never lie and it won't lie in the name of Jesus. Um, going into November, we are going to have early a.m. prayer time starting as well as evening prayer. So evening prayer will have a sister or a bigger brother, however you want to put it, uh, coupled along with with her in the name of Jesus in the month of November as we go and enter into the last part of December. I want to see some of you all overcome. I want to help intercede with some of you all. Take your prayers to the prayer room, to the throne room, and get some of your breakthroughs flowing and going. So make sure you text me 256-483-0356. Let me slow down. 256-483- 0356 with your prayer request as well as you can reach out to prayer dynasty at yahoo.com or angela gilbert ministries.com in the name of jesus you all and i would definitely take those prayer requests to the throne room sometimes i riding up and down doing my commutes and i just start lifting up individuals names hallelujah as i, I commute back and forth with prayer requests because i want to help you all get to your place of breakthrough get to your next place in life and just try on try on be triumphant in the name of Jesus. That's what that's who we are. It's heirs to the kingdom. We are triumphant in everything that comes our way. It's being parts of the king's kids. Hallelujah. And I say that without a smile. I'm very, very persistent when I say that. Being part of the king's kids. In the name of Jesus, you are overcoming hurdles. Hallelujah. I just hear the Holy Ghost saying overcoming hurdles and trials and tribulations and being able to stand against the winds of life when they start to blow in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And being able to come out on the other side and say, if it had not been for the Lord who was on our sides, side, where would we be? Is that your testimony? When you look back over 2020, all the things that you had to go through, things that took you, uh, some of you off of your, off of your, um, just kind of blindsided you. Some things that happened and occurred that you never thought would happen or occur. Some things that you knew that were going to occur, but you just didn't know how in-depth the Lord was going to uh, allow the occurrence to be. And you begin to see things that you never, ever really seen before, and you're just like, wow. So in the name of Jesus, if you had one of those wild moments however it may be maybe it was through uh, uh changing careers or maybe it was through changing cities or maybe it was through um however your old wow status was on this year if it had not been for the lord who was on your side where would you be? Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, let us pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we thank you and we praise you, Father God, for all that you have done for us in this year so far. We know that we have embarked in, upon a new season in you and of you, and we come in faith being grateful and giving the magnificent attention to whom deserves their magnificent attention and that's you father god 
We thank you for your precious dear son, Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We thank you for intimacy in the Holy Word. Hallelujah. Just being one with you, getting along with you, and sitting and reading your word uh, in the name of Jesus. God, we pray for a daily appetite to read your word all across this video, Lord. A daily appetite to read your word in some kind of shape, form, or fashion. I don't want to say shape, form, and fashion, but in some kind of intimate way, just being one with you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we continue to lift up the homeless. We continue to lift up family members. We continue to lift up friends. We continue to lift up co-workers. We continue to lift up, hallelujah, people that we meet on the street that we may never know, but we know that you have called us to pray and intercede for them. Lord, we thank you for the gift of being kind, of kindness, Lord. Father God, there is no one like you. Hallelujah. We glorify and we praise you and we thank you for all that you have done for us and all that you're going to do. In the name of Jesus, we do pray. Amen. Amen. Amen, you all. Y'all have a great evening. God bless.